Hey guys, it's our second day at Disney. Hi. Yep. Uh, a little bit of a different day for us. So, a little recap, this is what's going down. Jack, not feeling great. Didn't come to the parks with us this morning, just the four of us. Came solo to Epcot. Had a fun day, ate some fish and chips. It was yep. great. Uh, we had a boarding pass to get on to Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind. What? New ride, Cosmic Rewind. Guardians nice. of the Galaxy. Say that Cosmic five times fast. Rewind. It okay. So okay. we just wrote it. Just wrote it. Uh, Jack's feeling better. Amber's back at the apartment with him, and so we were like, you know what, man? If only there was a little bit of Disney magic, we could go back, get the rest of our squad, go to guest relations. Our friend Fred, which is actually an abbreviation of her last name. Her name is Sarah Fredericks or something, but her friends call her Fred. Fred hooks us up with passes oh to get on Guardians. Thank so we're going Fred. back to the condo yeah, to, to go pick up Amber and Jack, grab a little bite to eat, come back to Epcot oh around nine o'clock. We're gonna come back around nine o'clock. What's that movie reference from? Home Alone. Oh, Home Alone, gosh, I love my kids. Yeah. All right, anyway, so we're gonna come back around nine o'clock. Kids are scared of the dark. No, and then up, we're going to ride scared. Guardians again, and you're going to come with us. It's amazing! Okay, so again, shout out to Fred, Sarah. Hey, Fred. Appreciate that. We actually have a lightning lane pass that we can use, but we're going to go through the regular queue because... The regular queue is amazing. So we're gonna go check it out right now. Let's go. Jack's looking like a Disney I'm model. Here. Check, he's got his Disney oh. sneaks. Dang, bro. Oh, bam, like a Disney Instagram model. Fire, bro. Oh, my. Allies like the Ravagers and the Guardians of the Galaxy, they would never have survived. To discover more about these allies, let's return to my exclusive interview with the Guardians. And here he is now, Peter Quill. What did you have to say about this? Um, you know, I guess, I mean, it was really a group effort to execute my plan. Thank you, Gamora. I only said it because you told me to. Okay. I would love to hear more about how Tara was chosen for this wondrous Xandar tour. Well, that was totally my idea. And Epcot, too, because I love that place. It's awesome. I went there as a kid, and I, I, I mean, I cannot wait to get to go back and ride Horizons. Also want to see the energy, dinosaurs, and, of course, hear the veggie veggie fruit fruit. I mean, it's the best. Can't wait. <laughs> okay, well, I'm sure it will be wonderful for you to relive all of those memories again. And it's thanks to the Guardians that Xandar is reaching out to other cultures across the galaxy. This is crazy. Yeah. It's awesome. The queue is so cool. So crazy. What's beyond these I, well, Okay, I saw a glimpse in the uh, second room uh, when you walked in. Walt Disney was on the screen. Oh, you actually caught him on there? I caught a glimpse. So his, it's like his Epcot presentation? Uh, yeah. That's so cool. Yeah. yeah. Like... Greetings, Terrans. I am Nova Prime Irani Rayan, commander of the Nova Corps. On behalf of all Xandarians, I hope you have enjoyed exploring the wonders of Xandar. As you have seen, your world and ours were born at the same moment, one which you refer to as the Big Bang. As such, we are all galactic neighbors in a vast universe which we and countless others share. 
For you to travel to Xandar would take two and a half million years, assuming you had a ship that could fly at the speed of light. So we decided to come to you. But even we could not have reached you so easily were it not for the cosmic generator, an advanced piece of Xandarian technology that creates jump points, artificial tunnels that act as shortcuts linking distant points in space. It is our desire to share this wondrous technology with your people so that together we might explore new worlds and create a brighter tomorrow. And now, as the culmination of the wonders of Xandar, you will be teleported to a Nova ship above your planet for a demonstration of the Cosmic Generator. I trust you will find it an unforgettable experience. Welcome, people of Epcot. Epcotters. Epcotians. Citizens of Epcot. Does anyone know what they call themselves? What? I'm on. Someone needs to tell me what I'm on. Welcome, Epcot Terrans. I am Centurion Tau Merrick, and we're just about ready to teleport you up to the ship for the demonstration. I think 
was awesome. You are all heroes. So, do you really think they deserve to be called heroes? Or do you see how they dress? <laughs> Yo, what you think? <laughs> Come on. What you think, Jack? It goes What's our review of Guardians? I what do you think? 10 out of 10. 11 out of 10. I, it was literally... 100 out of 10. It was my favorite ride. It was incredible. It's my favorite Disney ride ever. It was incredible. I, but it's, I would argue it's my favorite ride. Like, of any theme park. Of any yeah. Yes. People yeah. Mover is right here. Guardians is like... Right here. Raise <laughs> that hand. Yeah. It was so much fun. So the music, cool. the scenery. The it's like the perfect mix of Guardians of the Galaxy, Rock and Roller Coaster, and Space Mountain. Yeah, yeah. it was yeah. awesome. It was so much fun across the board. Did you have fun, Peanut? Yes. Highly what, recommend. What did you like the most about it? Everything. Everything? Did you like the music? Yes. I remember, fun for the whole family. I think it like yes. progressed the entire genre of roller coasters. Oh, like, yeah, I've never absolutely. like danced on a roller coaster before. Yes. You know? <laughs> yeah. Well, I've so never, explained. I've also never had like the cart move like this. So like, I've never ridden a roller coaster sideways. Yeah. Oh my gosh. It was so crazy. Much. So it was crazy. awesome. We got so many good memories here at Epcot. I think that's probably a new core memory for me. All right, real quick, around the horn, top Epcot memory for you, like in your lifetime. Uh, so one time we did, we decided that the American Adventure, the show was happening like oh. five minutes, and we were where were we? We were at Figment, Figment, and so we decided to run halfway across the world <laughs> showcase yeah. and we got there in time i'm still tired uh, yes <laughs> yes we like still exhausted. full beeline for it that's good yeah. all right i what you um i remember on the last night of the nominations uh my dad and i went and ate fish and chips in the uk and watched that show that's like before my real life yeah yeah um, I just remember Merritt when she was super little, riding Figment and loving every second of it. Figment became her favorite thing. Yeah, so, so nice. I just remember that. I still remember uh, the time that we went to the holiday cookie crumble, and I yes. I would have finished everyone's cookies. <laughs> oh, that was cool. Oh, and liked all of them. I, I, liked, I loved all of them. Oh, and liked the food. How about you? Still I liked, um... I like when we all just hang out together. That's fun. Oh, that's sweet. I am mine's the same as Isaac's. Watching the last eliminations, down the water, eating fish and chips. It's like a cool memory for sure. And fish and chips. Fish and chips. Fish and chips. Always. Chips yeah. Always. Like, like Food and Wine Festival was always yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. The like so the pile de Kao from Brazil. Or just the lobster rolls. Yeah, so good. Like, the bao buns. Oh, the bao buns in Japan were so good. And oh man, you remember when we we saw um, what was it called the the Christmas thing uh, the Christmas thing in American theater uh, oh, the candlelight procession candlelight oh, we went to the yes. beer garden and ate the four yes, yes. Like candlelight procession was so much fun and it was so amazing. awesome we've had so many good memories here at Epcot yeah awesome we love it. Epcot yeah. love you we have another Epcot day coming up too yeah, yeah. Yeah, so so we actually have stuff. something that we get to do, a surprise that we get to do at Epcot the last night of our trip. It's going to be awesome. Cool. Okay. All right. Well, that was the end of day two. Stay tuned. See you tomorrow. <laughs>